Hello everyone, welcome back. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to deploy Microsoft Edge using SCCM or Configuration Manager. So here's the um, the link to Microsoft uh, website it shows you step by step. So I'm just going to create the package um, based on my knowledge. So what you need to do is you need to download the the MSI. There's two versions. One is the Microsoft Edge Develop Enterprise, and the other one is the Microsoft Edge. I'm sorry, the Develop Enterprise X86 and the X64 and X86. So let's go ahead and click on this link. So I recommend that you download the dev channel. The dev channels get updates every week. And the beta channels get updates every six weeks. So if you have two versions of Windows in your environment, x64 and x32, I recommend you download both. Let's try to download x64 first. Click on download, accept, close, and now download the x86, accept, as you can see it's downloading. So I have downloaded the package and I um, created on my share under Microsoft Edge x64 and 64 bit and a 32 bit it's in two different locations let's go ahead and create a package in sccm i'm going to here sccm console software library application management application packages so i'm going to call this by clicking the create applications and then you're going to automatically detect information about the applications click on browse I'm going to paste my link x64 here's the MSI click next Next, let's call this X64. Let's call it 64 bit. Install per system, that's fine. You can leave all this information blank if you want, but if you want to keep, you want to type in the information, you can. Publisher, you can type in Microsoft. I'm not sure what the version is, so I'm going to skip that for now. I'm going to go ahead and click Next. Click Next. All right, it's finished. Let's see. Actually, I'm going to rename this. This should be just Microsoft Edge. And the deployment type, this should be x64, 64-bit 64 contents, that's fine. Programs, you can leave that alone. Detection method, 
that's you can leave that alone user experience that's fine requirements so since this is x64 you want to make sure it's you configured operating system for x64 as well oops Windows 7, I have Windows 7 x64. You want to make sure you check all x64. And I have Windows 10 in my environment, it's x64. Click OK. OK. Now I'm going to do the 32 bit right click and go to create deployment type I'm going to paste the link from 32 bit it is MSI for 32 bit or x86 uh, x86 click next next so I'm going to call this 32 bit that's fine requirement so you want to make sure you choose operating system 32 bit all windows 7 32 bit and all windows 10 32 bit click ok click next next and next once you create it you need to distribute to your the, your dp right click and go to distribute content click next next choose the dp click ok next and next all right now it's finished i'm going to deploy i'm going to deploy as available so you could uh, right click and go to deploy choose the collection all client systems next as you can see it's available that means i can go, i can go into software center and install it manually from there click next next that's fine next and next let's see if the contents have been distributed let's click on edge all right oops contents distribution content status edge successfully deployed to the dp now go ahead and log into one of my client Let's log into this client. Now I should be able to install the the package from Software Center. I'm going to search for software search. Software Center. Hmm. 
Maybe I don't have SSM client on this box. Yep, that's right. I don't have SSM client. Let's go ahead and install Edge on my server. It's not there yet. Let's force the policy. Action. Machine policy retrieval. Click OK. It's going to take some time to show up. I'm going to pause the video and we'll come back. So actually, if I want to deploy on Windows 2012, I need to go back into the application deployment type. I need to configure X, um, Windows Server requirement as part of the requirement. Windows Server 2012 x64 and 2012 R2 x64. Might as well go with server 20 uh 2016 64. click ok let's go ahead and force the policy again All right let's um hold off and um we'll come back once the policy has received by this machine. <coughs> All right, look like Edge is there now. I'm going to click install. It's downloading the contents. It's installing. I'm going to minimize the screen. Here it is. Here's the icon. That's it. Thank you for watching. Please, if you like the video, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and have a great day.